Hello everybody and welcome back to Yalan app. In this video, I'm going to show you a step-by-step -step guide on exactly how to fix Blue Yonder workforce app not working. So if you're currently having that exact same problem and you want to be able to fix this, well then this video is going to be perfect for you. So actually what I did firstly was that I closed my app and instead I went into the settings app on my phone. So go into your settings app and as you can see, you should now be taken to a page very similar to this. Now in here, we're just going to scroll down and we're going to click on general. And as you can see, it should now take us to this page. In here, I'm just going to scroll down again and click on storage. And it's just going to take me a couple of seconds to load this page. And as you can see, you should now be taken here, which is great. So on this page, you're just going to scroll up in here until you can see up top, as you can see where it says search. So click on search. And in here, I'm just going to search for uh, I think it's actually like this BY, as you can see, and then WFM. So we're just going to click on this one right here. And then you're going to click on offload app. And once again, click on offload app in here. And then click on the blue button here again to be able to auto update your Blue Yonder Workforce app to its latest settings or to its latest, latest update. So basically by doing this, I guess that you're going to fix all the bugs that was in the previous version because when I did this, then it just worked for me when it was done. So try this and go back into the app and hopefully now it's working for you as well.